Hello, Ron. This is Joel from Metalink. There's the big difference between the old gold on our left and the new blue on our right, where your arms got extended so much better. See how much better your weight shift got. You weren't hanging back on your right foot so much in the new blue, even though you weren't even trying to improve that and just improved on its own as you tried to swing to this finish right over here on our right that I described to you, and you did it beautifully. Much better look with those arms extended there instead of these arms pulling back away from it for impact so much, Ron. Much more normal looking there. When you look at the tour players, that's what you're going to see. Instead of those curved arms and no re-hinge over here and you're through swinging into your follow swim through. This is a much better look here, the new blue, Ron. Much better look, like we're seeing with the tour players. And it doesn't matter which tour player we look at, they'd all look the same through there. Those arms extended like we're seeing more for you there on the new blue over here, Ron. Nice work. Talk to you soon. Hi, this is Joel. I'm here at Dr. Todd Elwert's office. He's one of the best chiropractors in the region. He's a TPI certified golf fitness professional. And I really want you to know about him because he can help you a lot with your golf fitness, just as he's helped my young student Taylor here in the last year or so. And how we met, Taylor came into my office with back pain. We basically what we took him through is numerous screens to find out why he had the back pain. I don't only treat back pain, but my, my second goal is to find out exactly why he has this problem. So we analyze him, we find out he has some certain weaknesses, we put him on some strengthening exercises, and he's doing very well. He's done great. He's had very little back pain, and that's mainly because he injured himself working too hard at the golf course. So he's done his exercises, he's felt great. I'm very, very thankful that Todd's been able to help Taylor in this great way. And I want him to help you, too, if you have any questions at all about your golf fitness. Thank you. Thank you. This is Joel Suggs. I sure enjoyed meeting you down at the Cincinnati Golf Show this weekend and showing you your swing on the 2D equipment that I have. And so I want to take about two or three minutes to just show you around Metalink. This is the studio I use in the winter for all my students. You see there's the down-the-line camera angle for our 2D equipment. And then we have the face-on camera angle also. And then what we also have here is... 3D equipment to where I can show you your swing from six different camera angles with this 3D equipment and we can get your swing from down to the 1 20th of a, 1 120th of a second in terms of exactly what your hips, shoulders, and hands are doing in the swing. And then also, we have, I have the most realistic hitting curve I've ever seen from PuttersEdge.com. So when you hit your full shots, it feels as realistic as possible. And then I have three different green speeds for you to practice your putting. 9.5 on the step meter, 10.5 on the step meter, and 12.5 on the step meter. That's benefited my students tremendously. And then also I have a lot of learning aids like this smart stick. You can see the rest of those learning aids over here in my bag that we can work on to help you learn a certain field in the golf swing that you and I both want. And then also I help my students a lot with their equipment through the winter. This is a frequency analyzer where we twang your club and it gives us a reading here. And then also we plot your whole set, each club on this, these lines to see if the set is really matched or not. Quite often they aren't and it helps my students tremendously when they find out what clubs are the offending clubs. And then if we get tired of being indoors and we want to go outdoors and get time, we can do that. It's my daughter. Ellie, good to see you. I haven't seen her in weeks. <laughs> no wonder you've been gone, Ellie. You've been out here playing in the snow all this time. But this is our natural turf area. This is closed until April, as you can see. Uh, but it's a fantastic area where we can step outside and hit some balls and get some real ball flight. Or, if you get pretty satisfied and things are looking better on the video here, we're kind of cooped up inside and want to go outside, we can step on out and hit balls and see real ball flight for about 5 or 10 or 15 minutes, however long you and I can stand the cold, out into the air and we see them land 
at these different flags. I have a yardage book for this driving range. It's the first one I've ever seen in my life where we know exactly what it is for the front, back, and middle of each screen. And again, the covered area here is heated, so we stay out there for about 5, 10, 15 minutes, like I said, and it enables us to see some ball flight. And then we get satisfied that things are looking the way we want, and we come back inside, take off our coat, and look again at the video equipment to see how you're doing looking to make sure that you understand it. And then notice too, my exercise ball up top here, and then also, so I help my students a lot with their fitness through the winter, and then I will help you also with your sports psychology, with your golf psychology from the golfpsych.com people down in Texas. That's helped my students tremendously a lot over the years too. So again, I sure enjoyed meeting you down at the Cincinnati Golf Show this weekend. I look forward to seeing you again out here this summer at Meadowlinks, or even right now in the winter. I have a lot of people that work on their games with me right through the winter. Check out more information about the things I do to help you at joelsuds.com. Take care.